Hey there, Kat here, and today we're going to be buying a Shire horse. So let's go! Are these not the most beautiful horses you've ever seen? Look how beautiful... <gasps> Look at this beauty. It looks like Silver Gift 2.0. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Look at how beautiful these dapples blend in. They're so subtle. I love it. I really want this one, but I already have Silver Gift though, and it's... It's like, it's just like Silver Gift, but like an upgrade, right? I know it's an Irish cob, Silver Gift, but still. Oh my god, look at the pink on that nose. Are you kidding me? Look how it fades into the white. Shut the front door. You've got to be kidding me. I don't know, this is so tempting. But see, I want, I don't want to feel like I'm just getting an upgraded horse of one I've already owned. Oh, this is so pretty though. Oh my god, look at the fur and the ear. Well, hello. Oh my god, look how realistic the nose looks with the little wrinkles there. I love that black spot in the nose and how it blends. I love the pink. This is so pretty. Wow, look at those silver eyes. I, this is really tempting. I, I don't know. I might have to get this one. Like the very first one I see, I just race right over here though because it looks so much like Silver Gift. I love it. It's so pretty and I can't get over that nose. It's so gorgeous. And I love that it's not all pink. I love that it's just that little area and then it's got the black in the nose. So, so pretty. This one isn't doing anything special for me. It just looks, it's like, I don't know. It's like too basic. Oh, I love the, those white hairs on its face though. That's really cute in the little pink spots. But the coat color itself... I don't know. It's just not one I get excited for. You know, it's cute and I'd be happy to have it, but pay for it? No. All right, let's take a look at this one. This is super cute. I really like the dapples in the dark brown here. It looks like a Clydesdale, you know, in those Budweiser commercials. That's all I'm picturing right now. That is such a cute nose. I love that they have those little wrinkles in the front of the nose now. And look at all the black spots in the pink. I love that. I like this one a lot so gorgeous and so much there's just a lot of intensity to the coat color like not intensity there's a lot of different layers like there's dapples there's shading i don't know it looks like a million layers put on there that is such a cute walk i like how it how its mane bounces in the trot very pretty canter look at the feathers flowing okay its walk is super cute and then like the rest of them i feel like it looks very nice how it carries it i really like all of them <laughs> That's so cute. Outlays down. The laying down and the walking, it looks like little, a, like a cartoon horse or something. Not the graphics, just the, I don't know, just the movements. It's really, really cute. All right, let's take a look at these ones. I really like these ones over here too, what I'm seeing already. The black horses, I'm not a big fan of black horses. I know it's got lots of white on it. It's got that cute little pink nose, but I'm just not a big fan of black coats. They just, I don't know. It's like the same with that light brown that we just looked at over there. They're just not, they just don't call my name, you know? This is gorgeous. Look at this deep, dark red. This deep, dark red in the brown. It's like the darkest red, brown red you can imagine. Ooh, and I love how it blends in the face. That's a really cute nose. Why are all these noses so cute? Those are some thick lashes. I'm really obsessed with the shading of this one. It's so like dark, dark, such a dark, rich color. So majestic. This is cool. I've never seen this coat color on a draft horse before. I really like the coat color. I'm not, I don't think I'm a fan of the mane and tail. Those, um, gray highlights in there. I don't like how they're, first off, they're really, really light compared to the rest of the hair. And they just like, it's just these long, uninterrupted lines. I feel like they should be more interrupted, like more blended in the hair. You know what I mean? It looks like somebody just took a pencil or a pen and just drew down. I don't really like that. Oh, look at those eyelashes though. They're so cute. They're like so white compared to the rest of its face. Oh, these highlights here, they're driving me crazy. What is with that? Look, it's even worse on the tail. Look at that huge, long line. I just wish it was either interrupted more, like not just one straight line. Oh, okay, this looks a lot better on this side. See, do you see what I mean? How it's like more in little chunks. And I just wish it wasn't so light compared to the rest of the hairs. I don't know. It just feels weird to me. But I love this black between the main coat and the feathers. That's really pretty. And how how well it blends into the gray. Oh, look, it has a little red on it too. I, that, I didn't notice that before. That's really cute. I love these little dapples. Are these called dapples? Or are these like what would you call them? Flea bites or something? But these little spots, they look so cute. I really like, oh, I really like, especially right here on the neck and the shoulder. I really like this color. I don't know. This is a tough call because I really like, like, four of these horses. Oh, what am I going to do? I don't know. I don't know. I really like Silver Gift 2.0 over there. She is stunning. But this is a really, really 
cool color. I have, look at the bottom lip. That looks so goofy. Okay, but I really like this coat color and I haven't really seen it on a uh, draft horse before. I can't get over this coat color. This is going to be tough because I really like both of the bay reddish coat colors. I'll just call them dark brown for, you, you know what I mean. I really like those. I really like So Gift 2.0 in this silver or whatever this is. That's another thing. I wish that Star Stable, like when you click on the info, it would tell you the name of the coat color you're looking at because I am clearly not proficient in the name of the coat colors and it would just make it so much easier. I don't know which one to get. This is tough. Okay, let's look at them all again, the ones that I'm interested in. I cannot get over this dark, deep, rich, rich color. It just looks so rich. It's like, it reminds me of like a really intense, delicious cup of coffee or like nice dark chocolate. It's just so rich, like a decadent dessert, you know? Am I hungry right now? What's happening? Okay, here we go. We can see all four of them in my view right now. It's tough. I don't know. I am the worst decision maker ever. If I never had to make another decision in life again, I would be so happy. I don't, I don't enjoy decisions. Silver Gift 2.0 is so gorgeous though. Look at the dapples are so subtle. She's so pretty. Her shading is on point and I cannot get over this nose with that pink right there. I love it. Okay, let's go back over here. Having a little bit of a crisis, it's gonna be okay. The richness though, it is so good. But see, because I can't decide between these two brown ones, it makes me not want to get either one of them because I don't, I, I don't like decisions. So, and it's too tough between the two and I really like this gray one right here. I, I don't know. I think I have to go with this one. I really do. Okay, I want her to be a girl. Let's see what the different hairstyles are here. That is really cute and with the mane up in the braid, it really shows off that muscular thick neck. I, ooh, I love the tail. Oh, and do you see it really gets rid of that? Most of the issue I have with the long lines on it. This one, I don't know. I did my Gotland Pony in braids like that once and then after a few days, it just drove me crazy. I don't like the short hair look on this one. Like, I like it up in the braids, but on the mane, I don't like that. This just feels like way too much, you know, like maybe in a parade, but everyday riding, I just, I don't like that. It's too much. That's cute, a little beard. I think I'm gonna go with the braids. I really like the little braids. Yeah, that's so cute to me. And the tail, it, it gets rid of that issue, really. Because I like it long like that, but with the, it's just those long white streaks, it just ruins it. So if it didn't have that, I'd keep it long. But because of that, I think I'm gonna do this. And then it just gets rid of the, what I don't like. Oh, we gotta do a name for her. Oh my god. Okay, I'll be back in like five million hours. Okay, I picked. It took a very long time, but I'm going with Diamond Girl. Oh wait, did I? I forgot to pick the gender and age. Well, it's too late now. Do you guys like this cutscene or no? I feel like it doesn't really add much. Like, it's cool the first time, but then it's just like, okay, I'm over it. I like that you can instantly ride them now, though. Look at me, yes. Oh, I gotta get tack, though. Okay. This is unfortunately as good as it's gonna get for now. Let's go. You are so cute, you deserve this apple. Okay, obviously we're gonna need a few pictures. She is so, so gorgeous. I do not regret the decision I make, that I made. See, if I would have gotten one of the brown ones, then I would have just constantly been like, oh, but should I have gotten the other brown one? But this is perfect. I think she's going to fit in perfectly with everyone. She's gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I love the movements. The walk is super cute. The lay down is super cute. The rest of them really like uh, graceful looking. I love her. I love her. I love her. I love her. So this is Diamond Girl. I like her name too. What do you think? Is the name cheesy? I'm not very good at picking the names. What would you name this one? If you got a Shire, tell me what color of Shire you got and tell me what you named it. And if it's like a stallion, a gildy, and a mare, I'm just curious. Anyways, I think she's gonna fit in perfect and she's already found the food. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye. So majestic.